So, Mac knows exactly what day it is. It is Bark Box Day. And he's been so patient with me. So we are going to open his Super Chewer Bark Box for you for February. And we're going to see what's inside. So, Bark Box, if you're not aware, they have a theme every month. And every theme is different. <laughs> different. They send... Um, toys, treats, and shoes. They don't send any accessories or anything. He's not much of an accessory dog. He's got like the thickest neck I've ever seen. So it's hard to find anything that'll actually fit him. You know, hi Bubba. And uh, Mac is allergic to beef, chicken, and eggs. So we have to be really good about getting him stuff <laughs> that is um, compliant with that because he gets really bad yeast infections. Can I at least show them what the theme is, bud? Before you get di dive in there. It must be something that smells really good. Okay. So this is the Super Chewer. For dogs like him that can chew like crazy. Mac here is a two-year-old Old English Bulldog. And he's just the sweetest, sweetest boy I've ever known. So, you ready to see what's inside? <laughs> okay, so... It comes, oh, Mac, you were so good last time we did this on the bed. I know, you've been patient. You've been patient. Okay, so, it, they come wrapped really nicely. He kind of just crushed all the pretty wrapping. But they're colorful. And it looks like this month the theme is Candy Shop. I don't know if you guys can see that. So they always come with this little um, booklet or whatever to tell you what the theme is. And a lot of times it has little games or activities. So if you have kids, they can do the little game and activity. A lot of times it has stuff you can do with your dog. So it looks like this is a scratch and sniff. That's probably why you're grabbing at it. Let's see. That does smell like leather. It's supposed to be like sneakers. What about, I don't want to know what a dog butt smells like. Is that the one you're interested in? It is. That's the one he's interested in. So it must really smell like a dog butt. Okay. Can you sit down? Okay. Good boy. Let me get that out of the way. And we will do toys first. I always forget to bring scissors, but always make sure you take off tags and everything. So the first thing is this giant pretzel and it's a smoky bacon scented pretzel that's that what you want okay let me try and take this off mac destroys everything absolutely everything so there you go he's not allowed up here with toys so he's gonna get down um so last month he got like a uh I don't know, it was like a squeaky ball thing, and he completely destroyed it within a day. Like, ripped the squeaker out, destroyed. So, I emailed BarkBox, and I let them know, like, I know it's super chewer, but that toy just wasn't up to par. So, they actually sent us free replacement toys, and they sent us a chew with it. So, that was really nice. Um, and they have a... I don't even know how many days it is, but like a guarantee on their toys. So if your dog does destroy them, you can get replacements for free. So that was really nice. So they sent us a big plastic, I don't know if it's plastic, like it's good for their teeth, I guess. But it was a lot like that, um, that pretzel, except it was like smoky something else scent and he loves it. So he's going to town down there on that. The second thing, look how cute this is. It's like a gumdrop for the candy shop. It's spinning like crazy. But it has openings on the bottom. Yeah, you see this. Openings on the bottom so you can stick treats or whatever in there and they can try and get that out to try and, it'll keep them occupied longer, you know, if you give them something to do. So this is the Treats and Sweets Gumdrop Treat Dispensing and it's dishwasher safe. I've never seen that put on a toy before. It's dishwashing. I gotta take the tags off before you can have this. I know, buddy. I know you want it. Um, I'll give this one to you later, okay? 
Let's go on to treats. A lot of times BarkBox will run promotions. If you sign up, you'll get like extra treats every month or extra chews or toys, something like that. This is just the basic box, so there's no extras in this. So they've got two bags of treats. All of their treats are made in the USA. They are all wheat, soy, and corn free for dogs with allergies. And I know they're usually really good about making sure nothing with chicken or beef end up in my box, but I always read to make sure. So these are bacon and berry, blueberry and bacon dog treats. And he knows he always gets to try them when I open them. So they smell just like blueberries. It smells just like blueberries. So there they are. They're like little drops. Like if you were to take like a cookie scoop and put it on a tray, that's, it does. It smells just like, it, it smells more like peanut butter than bacon, but whatever. There you go. So that's a win. He loves that. And then the second treat, oh, these are peanut butter. So these are peanut butter dog treats. Let me read the ingredients. Okay, so nothing in there either. Okay. Ooh, definitely peanut butter. So these are, oh, you can't see that. These are little, oh, I almost dropped it. Little heart shapes for Valentine's. I really need to figure out how to get closer to everybody because this is too far away. You're already sitting. Can you lay down? Can you lay down? You're too distracted. You are drooling everywhere. There you go. Okay. So that is his peanut butter dog treats. And then, like I said, they come with two chews in the box every month. So this month, this looks like a lamb link sausage type thing. And this is by Jones Natural Chews. This is also made in the U.S. So that is lamb. A lot of times, instead of giving him this whole thing, I'll break it up into smaller pieces and kind of use them as a treat as well. Just, he can go through one of these, one of these chews in like a half hour. So we always give him treats when we put them in the crate when we leave. So I, you know, if I'm feeling especially guilty if we've been gone a long time, I'll give him like a good chunk of this as well. And then... This one, he gets these a lot. These are by Play-Doh Pet Treats. And this is duck, and he loves duck. So he's eyeing this very, very inter interestedly. That's, I don't think that's a word, but... But that is what is in your box, bud. So like I said, this was the February Bark Box Super Chewer. And I'm going to have to get this off of here before I give that to him because I don't want him choking on the string. It's like tied from the inside so I don't know I'll just have to cut it. So I can put some of these treats in his gumdrop. He like I don't dogs can't see color right? There you are. You can't see color. Okay. So that is what I'm gonna do and we are gonna have a great day. I was hoping to get him to the park before I did this video but I know. But it is freezing rain outside, so we are stuck inside for now. Um, and he was actually well, much better behaved. And he knows he can't have toys up on the bed, so I'm glad he jumped down without me yelling at him. That is all Mac and I have for you. So, I would love if you guys would like and subscribe. Mac would like you too. Come back up here, bud. Let's say goodbye to everybody. He's not paying any attention anymore. Come here. Come on. Okay. On the other side. <laughs> oh, there we go. I know. I know. <laughs> we would love to keep making these videos for you guys. So that is all from Mac and I. And uh, we will be seeing you during our next video. <laughs> okay. Can I turn it off now? Okay. Okay. Okay.